As Indiana sets a new daily record for coronavirus cases, Governor Holcomb is announcing new restrictions tonight. Thank you for choosing us. I'm Brian McElhaney. And I'm Caitlin Kendall. More on the new rules in moments, but first let's take a look at those numbers. There were 5,156 new cases, bringing that total to more than 224,000. And 31 new deaths were reported, bringing that total to more than 4,500. In this, in his weekly COVID-19 briefing this afternoon, Governor Eric Holcomb said that Hoosiers have become complacent with COVID fatigue and imposed new restrictions as hospitals become overwhelmed with patients. As ABC 21's Corinne Rose reports now, as she has details that you should know about. Too many have said, we'll just write it out. And if I get it, so be it. And that brings us to where we are today. Governor Eric Holcomb says Indiana is in a second wave of the coronavirus pandemic, with numbers doubling each week for the past four weeks. The majority of the increase is a result of community spread and pandemic fatigue. We're hearing that people are refusing to wear masks, that some employees are being told to come to work even when they're supposed to be on quarantine, and that parents won't test their children for fear of having to quarantine. In order to help hospitals that are already on the verge of being overwhelmed with admitting 210 new COVID patients a day, the governor is implementing new restrictions. We must do all we can to protect our hospital capacity so they can protect patients and care for them, not only for those who have the COVID, but for the cancer patient and the heart patient and the other Hoosier patients who need care. Here's why. 26.3 of Indiana's ICU beds and 77% of the ventilators in the state are available. However, in Northeast Indiana, only 15.8% of 304 ICU beds are available right now, with 27% of them being used by COVID patients. That means in our 11-county area, only 48 ICU beds are available to patients who need them for any reason. As for ventilators, hospitals in our area report that 71% of them are still available, with more than 10% being used by COVID patients. Governor Holcomb says beginning Saturday, businesses will be required to post signs saying masks are required. In Orange counties, inside and outside gatherings are restricted to 50 people. High school sports attendance is limited to 25%, and non-family groups must social distance. Red counties are restricted to gatherings of 25 people, and high school sports attendees are restricted to participants, support staff, and parents. We have to affect that change now because the doubling of cases that we've had for the last three or four weeks is an exponential growth that is very difficult to get out of without these changes. Church congregations are strongly encouraged to maintain social distancing or worship remotely. The governor's order will last through Thanksgiving, and he's asking Hoosiers to restrict holiday gatherings to immediate family and travel only if necessary. Corinne Rose, ABC 21.